from Sydney, Fantastic Furniture's The U2 Cedars. Let's go to Cleveland! Hey! G'day guys, we're the U2 Cedars from a company called Fantastic Furniture, all the way from Sydney, Australia. My name is Peter Vernon, I'm one of the singers in the band and I'm also Fantastic Furniture's IT manager. Hi there guys, my name's Craig Evans, I'm a store manager with Fantastic Furniture and I'm one of the vocalists in the band. Howdy y'all, or good day. Uh, my name is Stephen Morton, um, one of the singers in the band as well. I also work for Fantastic Furniture, obviously, um, one of the managers just out of Sydney. And my name's Joel Cocking. Um, I'm one of the singers in the band as well, there's plenty of us. Um, and I'm a store manager as well at our Castle Hill store in Sydney. My name is Carolyn Cox. I look after the retail division of Fantastic Furniture and in the band I'm in charge of the percussion. For me it's something that when my little son's older, it's something I'll tell him about, you know. Um, you have those moments in your life that you want to tell your kids and your grandkids. And to be able to come all the way from Australia, and sing somewhere so famous where so many famous people have appeared. To see Aretha Franklin on, on the same billboard that Corporate Battle of the Bands is on, it's unbelievable. One of those moments in your life that you'll never forget. So. Yeah, the atmosphere outside is just amazing. Like just the people here, you know, the people that are here today just aren't here because they like music, they're here because they love music. And we're one of those sort of type of people, like we're one of the companies that we love music and we love our jobs and we love what we do. And to be at the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, well, we couldn't ask for anything else. And just to be amongst such um, talented people that may not day to day be true musicians, but, you know, aspire to be those, like, hey, should we quit our day jobs? I don't know. <laughs> Okay, well, like I'm 22 years old, okay, so I've never even been outside Australia before, so this experience in general is awesome for me and everyone else, I'm sure, but like it's a great chance to perform in a great venue, which I probably would have never been to if it hadn't been for this competition. About a year ago, that um, they came with, us, with the idea of going to the Australian Battle of the Bands, we thought, oh, yeah, we'll go in for a bit of fun. Like even just performing at the Sydney Entertainment Centre was just amazing. Like, but then now we're here, the Rock Hall of Fame, and it's just mind blowing. It's amazing. I guess I entered these guys as a bit of a joke, <laughs> and as part of the rules, a senior executive had to be in the band. Two of our uh, directors actually played the guitar, and they both backed out. <laughs> so I ended up in the band by default. <laughs> And they said, that's okay, you can play the tambourine. But we still had to bring our level. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm here because the rules in Australia said they need a senior exec. So that's the only reason. <laughs> so if I'm out of beat, that's why. <laughs> Um, I, I mean, just to describe the emotions is just unbelievable. The atmosphere back home um, amongst the company is just absolutely amazing. We work for uh, what I believe is the best Australian company. And um, the incentive that the company gives us to come to work day to day, um, and then the opportunity for us to perform outside of it and to do things like we're doing here today, it's just, it's just mind blowing. And, you know, again, I'm only 26 and I think to myself, wow, like in 70 years I'll, I'll retire and, you know, I'll retire at Fantastic Furniture. And I just think to myself, you know, what a, an achievement to have being at the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame and doing it as part of my day to day work as well. And, I just can't I just can't describe it and the support that we have back home is just amazing um, every single person within our company you know um, w whether they spoke to us in person or gave us a call or emailed us you know everybody's behind us everyone's been behind us from the day we started and it, I just can't describe it do you know what I mean we're a company we're a family company we stick together when we do something we do it well we do it all together and we never say die and that's our philosophy and at the end of the day if we don't win it doesn't matter because we're not here to win we're here to enjoy ourselves enjoy the excitement that's around us have a great time and just be a part of something that's just so exciting for a good cause i think it's good it gives other people something to aspire to within the company. If we enter in the future, there'll be other people there now that'll come forward. We held the auditions a little bit like Australian Idol. I guess you have American Idol here. And we made everybody come and actually